продолжим рабочий день в Бразилии. We continue our working day in the UCMC, and now we are given the floor to Colonel Andrei Lysenko, Ministry of Defense of Ukraine spokesperson on NATO-related issues. Good afternoon, dear colleagues. Uh, we provide you an update for the uh, previous day in ATO area. Despite the announces fire and the uh, contact line, the uh, shellings uh, intensified again. Uh, a total of 54 ceasefire violations were recorded yesterday in, in the ATO area. Uh, four times the enemy uh, opened mortar fire in the key defense areas. They were shot and uh, they were conducted in Donetsk and Mariupol uh, sector. They also provoked a combat clash with Ukrainian defensemen. In Lugansk sector yesterday, the enemy four times opened fire with small arms on our positions, three times in Novandarsk district, and one time uh, they used sniper rifles uh, in Troitsk near Papasna. The shellings were not long. Uh, uh, they were conducted in daytime, and they were of provocative nature. In the Donetsk sector, most tense uh, situation was observed. The militants uh, violated ceasefire in the daytime alone uh, the front line. Uh, the shellings were longer, from 20 minutes to 30 minutes. Uh, the occupants uh, used mostly small arms and grenade launchers. At the same time, in the area of Donetsk airport, our strong strongholds came under uh, fire of um, uh, hostile sniper. Uh, the militants group uh, in Evdivka industrial area launched four mortar bombs. Uh, a total of 20 ceasefire violations were recorded in Donetsk sector yesterday. In Mariupol sector, the situation is also tense. Uh, from the very no morning until midnight, the, the militants uh, fired on our positions uh, along the entire contact line in Marinka district and district uh, to the west of Dokuchaevsk. In Novotroyevsk, uh, the militants used sniper rifles and they uh, fired with mortars near Krasnogorevka and Bogdanovka. Uh, after uh, 4 p.m., our servicemen prevented the movement of sabotage group. Uh, the uh, crossing of the front line near Marinka was prevented. Uh, when Ukrainian servicemen uh, detected the movement of uh, enemy, uh, they prevented them uh, opening the fire. In Mariupol sector, there were 30 uh, ceasefire violations, including three mortar shellings and one combat clash. Uh, uh, no Ukrainian servicemen died yesterday in action. Uh, five servicemen uh, were wounded in action. Uh, yesterday in the ATO area, uh, the law enforcement uh, 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 officers uh, together with security service officers uh, detected uh, ammunition uh, arsenals. In Lugansk region, uh, in Starobilsk district, uh, the law enforcement officers uh, found uh, the uh, cache with ammunition where they detected two grenade launchers, RPG-26, four grenade, uh, grenades of different modifications, and more than 150 cartridges. In Mariupol, a local citizen uh, found uh, the package with the munition uh, near the road and uh, informed the law enforcement officers. Uh, they found there four uh, grenade shells, uh, Vogue uh, 17, a grenade with a fuse, and more than 2,000 uh, cartridges of various calibers. In Teretsk, uh, uh, the men found uh, a mine, a landmine, uh, and uh, informed the police about this uh, 
finding in the International Center of uh, Peacemaking and Security in Lvivsk uh, region, 55-day training um, of the 28th separate uh, motorized brigade of the armed forces of Ukraine have been con completed. The exercises were conducted uh, uh, with the uh, um, engagement of the expert of the uh, armed forces of the USA, Canada, Poland, D uh, Denmark. And the trainings were uh, 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 integrated. Uh, such important topics as tactics of combat actions, uh, uh, neutralizing of mines, medical assistance, uh, and evacuation of the wounded uh, were trained. Now this battalion uh, will uh, also be um, uh, conducting uh, training along with other units of 28th Brigade. In Lviv and ivano Franskivsk regions, uh, uh, the uh, uh, exercises uh, with the uh, air companies units uh, uh, and communication units will be conducted. Uh, that's all for today. Thank you. Uh, are there any questions? Uh, we have no questions. Uh, thank you, Mr. Colonel. Uh, thank you. Next briefing of the ATO speaker will be tomorrow at 12.30.